Daily Devotional for April 30th. Today's scripture reading will be Luke 4, verses 42 and 43. Now when it was day, he departed and went into a deserted place. And the crowd sought him and came to him and tried to keep him from leaving them. But he said to them, I must preach the kingdom of God to the other cities also, because for this purpose I have been sent. Now, do you realize we're supposed to be doing the same thing? He said that he must go to preach the kingdom of God. And he was going to different places. I think sometimes we limit what God wants to do through us. Um, we may only minister to our family. And when I say minister, I'm saying teaching what God has already placed in us and what he's taught us, we share with others. But sometimes we're shy, we're bashful, whatever. We only want to speak to maybe our loved ones or maybe our neighbors. And we limit what God wants to do through us. You know, he's given us all testimony. He's done a great work in all of our lives, and he continues to work in us. So we need to be sharing the goodness of God, his gospel. What is he doing? What has he done? How has the word ministered to us? Share that wherever you go. Uh, you know, the disciples were sent out. And of course, Jesus, he went out also. So he was teaching to everyone that he came in contact with. And it's what the person needs. You know, somebody may need a word of wisdom. Someone may need in encouragement. Someone may need prayer for healing or deliverance. Whatever, whatever that person needs is what we should be able to give them. God is not limited. Holy Spirit lives in us. Therefore, we have all the resources we need. If we need a scripture, he is the scripture. He is the living word. And we just need to seek him for what somebody needs. It could be the, the clerk at the grocery store. You know, it could be the fellow at the gas station. It could be a stranger you pass on the street. You know, as you're passing that person walking down the sidewalk, Holy Spirit may quicken to you something that that person needs. Don't go past them. Turn around and go back to them and give them the word of the Lord because that will open up uh, a whole new arena to them because it's the word of God. I remember one time the Lord sent me somewhere and, and I was just seeking him and he actually sent a man to me asking for uh, direction. And I was trying to get rid of that man so I could hear the Lord. Well, he sent him to me the second time. I sent him away the second time. And he sent him back to me yet the third time. I'm like, oh my gosh. Uh, it, I was hard-headed that day. I realized this was my assignment. And you know what? That man, with the words that the Lord gave me, it unlocked his heart. It set that man free. We are on a mission for God all the time. So let your heart be enlightened. Let your mind be one with his so that you can deliver his word and his message when he needs it. Don't limit what God wants to do through you. Be blessed till next time.